द वाइट बलून रिटन बाय अब्बास के रस्तामी एंड डायरेक्टेड बाई हिस्स प्रोटीजर जफर बनाहिन कैन बी अ ग्रेट डबल बिल विद द फॉर्मर्स नाइनटीन एटी सेवन फिल्म एंड द फर्स्ट ऑफ द कोकर ट्रिलजी वे इज द फ्रेंड्स हाउस बोथ फिल्म फील लाइक जर्नीज वे आर लिटिल प्रोटागनिस्ट हैव टू कैरी आउट अ डिफिकल्ट टास्क बाई नाविगेटिंग चैलेंजिंग इन्वायरमेंट्स इन दिस वीडियो दो लेट्स फोकस ऑन द वाइट बलून The whole film revolves around Razia desperately wanting a new goldfish for the new year. She goes all out to get her wish for film and ultimately gets the green light. On her way to the shop, two snake charmers give the impression that they would sneak out the little girl's 500 note. They do take it but put it back into her fish bowl. Razia reaches the shop and asks for the fish but soon realizes she doesn't have the money. Again, everything is staged as if to indicate the possibility that the shopkeeper must have stealthily taken it out later with the help of a kind old woman that he has spots the money in a pit at the entrance to a store that has been closed for the new year celebration with a slap mark on his face her elder brother also joins in but both of them are unable to find a solution the hot tempered abuse of father who we never actually see in the film is constantly at the back of our minds what if the siblings can't fetch the money and go home without it in the midst of it all a young soldier creeps in and like those snake charmers and the shopkeeper he is also made out to look suspicious but turns out harmless in the end these brilliantly written characters add more depth to the film keeping the audience slightly on the edge finally the balloon seller who we see at the beginning of the film saves the day he goes out and fetches some chewing gum to stick at the end of the wooden stick after a few attempts they find success as soon as they retrieve the money the brother leads his sister to hurry away to the shop however to our utter surprise we never get the shot that we were waiting for all these 80 minutes the money shot at the shop of that of a super happy razia finally getting her hands on the fish bowl with a big fat fish inside it instead of that the camera stays at the poor balloon seller and his apparent disbelief the film's ending is a whiplash it subverts the audience's expectations of a traditional happy ending the 1.5 minute long take has some familiar faces getting in and out the siblings again make an appearance this time with the goldfish and again ignore their savior Forget a proper thank you the balloon seller doesn't even get a kind glance for his efforts he's casually ignored a cyclist passing by sums it all up the siblings do have a reason though they are preoccupied with their own concerns they have to reach home asap the ending perhaps is a subtle and poignant commentary on the complexity of human experience and human interaction the many different ways in which we perceive and respond to the world around us it invites viewers to consider the ways in which our own motives perspectives and biases may limit our understanding of the world and to reflect on the importance of empathy and awareness in building understanding between people from different backgrounds and cultures